We recreated Renal's jewelry pieces from Avatar The Way is Water. So now let's tackle the bodysuit and tail. Got a bodysuit off of Amazon. It's a fleshy tone painting with skin illustrator, mint julep and concentrate. So originally I did plan to use my car detailing brush. Now I neglected to check my adapters and it was losing too much pressure and I just didn't want to spend the whole afternoon fixing it. So then I jumped to the regular airbrush and that is just gonna take way too long. So finally, I resorted to using a brush and the reason I did not start out this way is because the makeup is going to seep right through the material and end up all over my skin and that's just a whole other mess to have to clean up when I'm done. Got a face coat and threw it on a form and started the markings with Skin Illustrator Teal Concentrate. Using concentrate instead of the regular liquids because it's gonna build up the color a lot faster. Create blotchy striping and then go in and outline the areas. You wanna keep the lines nice and wiggly because that's gonna make it look more organic than as as opposed to doing a straight solid line. Also bring those stripes to the front of the body. Doing just as we did on the back. Now the limbs. I did stuff them with foam to help keep somewhat of a shape. And also this is a great time to finish painting any of that mint julep area that you may have missed. Same with the legs. This process did feel like it took forever, but better that I took the time on a suit than to paint my body and just wash off all that hard work at the end of the day. Spatter some teal for a little more texture and extended the markings on the shoulder. Flicking teal over everything, then some white concentrate. The tail is made out of EVA foam. Sketch the design and cut it out. The foam was keeping a curve, so we're just gonna heat that up and it will flatten out. Cut out pieces for the base area of the tail using barge to glue them onto the main piece. Now it looks really boxy, so let's taper that and sand it. A little hand sanding just to smooth it out further. Foam clay will help to refine that transition. Now to attach it on the body, cut out a hole and pull elastic through. Did machine sew those ends and trim the back just so it sat better on the body. Paint it with mint julep and the markings with the teal, just like the body. And spatter the teal in white. Now the feet. Building up the toes with cotton and latex and letting that dry then build up some more. Now we're gonna add some toe knuckles. Grab some fake nails and trim them down. For the big toe, I did heat up the plastic a little to help widen it. Careful when doing this, because too much heat is just gonna warp the nail. Glue them on with Pelisys Betavon Plus and build up that nail bed. Now, if you're looking for a more in-depth tutorial on the techniques to create these creature feet, there is a tutorial in the description below. Now we'll prep the surface up with 50-50 mix of Beta Bond and acrylic paint. That way the paint will stick to the shoe. It's gonna take a couple layers to get rid of that black. Base coat with mint julep and then add those teal markings. Skin Illustrator Dark Moss for some shading and spatter the teal in white. Then went over the shaded areas with the teal just to kind of blend it all together. Clean up the nails with some alcohol and added a wash of that teal color over the nails and also using the color to refine those nail beds. Now we have everything prepped and we're ready to apply the makeup. So head over to the next video and let's finish out this project.